Good morning, everyone. Good morning. This is take two because I lost the internet. Um, I am popping in because I am preparing for the 2025 energies and I'm at Sunrise Sunshine Beach. Like Hell's Gate, what we know uh, here on the Sunshine Coast, Hell's Gate is just here. I'm on the opposite side and I'm going to charge um, doing a meditation uh, to finish some uh, processes off and also bring in the energies, get preparing for 2025. Now, a lot of this information is going to be in my one day seminar offline. It's the 9th of November and online. It's the 10th of November to cater for those that are interstate international. Uh, but I just wanted to share, um, like I'm at the edge of a cliff. You'll see the beach here and the beach is on the other side. This is my little secret spot that I go to when I need some time and I do. As I started the ascension, meaning stairs, the ascension to here, which is quite steep, oh, some tears were coming up and I'm like, okay, not sure, let's just, just tap that out, move it on, whatever it is. And then I said, I need the whales and the dolphins to support me through this process. Now this is all related to mystery school, still medical intuition, but still mystery school as well. And I'm gonna go up the end and show you in just a moment because the dolphins are just there. I've already gone around the other side and seen the dolphins and I can hear the whales flopping on the, I've got technical terms, flopping on the water. Uh, and so what am I preparing for? And I'm showing this just in case you guys can relate to this. We've got full moon on Tuesday, number one. We've just done Lionsgate, number two. According to the Secret Codes to Manifesting, the Millennium Calendar, um, August is the time of projecting and planning what you want. Uh, we've got Mercury retrograde at the moment, prepare for something. Uh, we've got another retrograde coming up uh, as well, and I've forgotten the date now, which is Uranus, again, preparation. Uh, and so all of these things are lining up for us. So medical astrology, I teach all of this and it's still related to mystery school. And so my preparation is because as of the 23rd of September, 2025 energies comes in. We overlap for quite a bit. And so in that process, I want to prepare. I welcome it in. Just like here in Queensland, we have had extreme cold and wet and then yesterday was like 30 degrees, blue skies like this. I'm wearing um, my singlet top. I did have my jumper on, uh, but my singlet top, the weather's just pfft, done a turnaround. Um, always before my events is a big downpour. So like Ascension Charco was over the weekend and it was a downpour. Like all these things are lining up beautifully for us, absolutely beautifully. So what's the preparation? Come with me. I'm just gonna walk this track. You'll see um, a thin little track here and a thin little track, like hardly anyone comes this way. Now I won't be able to see because the sun's now in my eyes and I'm hoping the internet uh, is working as I speak because I tried it back over there and it wasn't working. And I just need to watch the rocky pathway. Why am I preparing? Oh, look at the paper flower, what they call uh, paper flower. Stunning sacred geometry. Oh my goodness me. Why am I preparing? Well, this actually relates to my journeys to Egypt, which are very, very sacred. Um, and I've got four booked in for 2025. And they don't even know the itinerary, but they know they need to be there. And in fact, two people said, I can't afford not to be there. And so this relates to 2025, it relates to um, Egypt, Atlantis is a big one. So let me just show you around, just coming to the end right now. Beautiful sunrise, the golden rays. Gold was used in ancient Egypt, which is ancient Egypt, Nubian, Atlantis, Galactic. Just show you around the coast. Oh, I can feel my energy. Oh, Bron, my darling. In actual fact, Bronnie, 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 you just triggered something. If you guys want to be with me as I sit right at the end over here, and then the cliff goes down. If you want to be with me as I draw in the energy, how about you pop your name down and I'll include you in the healing process for bringing in 2025. All right, just gotta watch my steps so I don't fall off the cliff. Uh, I'd like to just connect. I'm thinking, thinking. Oh, it's so beautiful here. And if you're ever on the coast, let me know. I'll bring you here. Um, I'm thinking I might just sit here. 
I'll just show you, I've got a bit of a rock pool here, but I've got the golden rays and I want to be right in line with the golden rays. So I'll sit just down here behind the rock on the cliff. So, uh, like Donna's written, I've just got to turn around for a moment, guys, so I can see you. Donna's got, love it, yes, please, Donna. Just, yeah, write your name, maybe put a gold heart emoji next to it so that we've got the golden rays. Bronze got, yes, please, and thank you, my pleasure. Just pop your name down so I can include you. Um, so I'll do that once I finish this because I want to make sure I'm down there focused. So bringing in the energy, why? Related to ancient Egypt and the journey this year for those that are coming with me. Um, oh my gosh, not long to go, about five weeks. Um, and next year for those that are coming, it is the high priestess energy. Uh, and that relates to 2026, like this big massive stuff relates to mystery school and Atlantis and all of that. Gosh, guys, I hope you can all come to Egypt with me. Um, that because uh, it's not just the normal touristy stuff; it, it is an activation um, process related to Atlantis. That um, 2025 energy is about complete a cycle, and especially for the high priestesses. Now, I'm going to give you different names because if you think oh, I don't relate to being a high priestess, high priestess, mystic, a misery of light, shaman, Wicca, witch, um, healer guide angel uh so many names shaman so so many names whatever name but i'm just gonna goddess i'm gonna call it high priestess for the name of just this one in actual fact i actually talk about about the golden ones and um so if you can relate to any of those in a past life or now um and especially what did they do um like there's some beautiful ah donna i was just thinking of you um i was just thinking of donna that some of the high priestesses specifically work with animals and then Donna pops up Donna thank you very much some work with children some work with um, minors some work with defense force some work with police force some are in the police force that they don't have to be just a healer but they know that they're here to raise the awareness not consciousness awareness which is heart space and help raise the awareness to the new paradigm and so if you can relate to any of that as i said you don't have to be a healer this lifetime in fact i had someone that did the ascension chakra course and she said i've never done any healing work i don't count myself as a healer and yet i and when she did a medical intuitive process with me she connected with her high priestess oh my god it was just amazing connected with her high priestess integrated that lifetime I said do i have to be a healer this lifetime so in regards to the 2025 energies, it's completing a cycle related to all of those lifetimes, which is Aztec, Incan, Mayan. They're the three bottom chakras. Um, then we've got Atlantis, Lemuria. Uh, we've got ancient Egypt. We've got the higher frequencies, and these still relate to chakras and things. Um, Pallades, Arcturians, Hathors, etc., like etc., etc. All of those. Um, that all of those lifetimes, medieval, were the times of wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, mystery school, etc. Next year is the completion stage. And so my role, I remember my many multiple lifetimes, lots and lots. And each time I was here to support the high priestesses, remember it's just a name, this lifetime could be anything, um, that support them. So get out there and support the world. Well, I need to prep myself as well so so much prep myself um what's tina go good morning tina there's another high priestess uh, donna's got her name down it looks divine where you are hey donna i'm at sunrise sunshine my darling um so we've got hell's gate just there um if you ever want to go for a walk uh tina uh oh yes it's so beautiful and you know tina like um just having come back from egypt guys i always have to come back to the water because i love egypt and i remember the water around the pyramid and sphinx I kind of connect with the water and then because I'm about to go back to Egypt I've got to have some more water uh, before I go and there's another lifetime mermaid energy as well um, the mystic so next year is preparing for a finish off like complete the cycle just complete the cycle and the cycle is where um, we felt like here's a doozy and see if some of you can write to it and if you're wanting a healing while well, I'm at the end of the cliff just here I'm gonna sit behind that rock we're not that rock because people can't see me. Um, I'm going to sit there and do some healing meditation prepping for 2025. And if you want to be included, just pop your name down. Pop your name down with a gold heart or something. 
that in that process of um, what are we completing, a lot of those lifetimes, especially especially Atlantis and the ancient Egypt of uh, ancient Egypt, Nubian Egypt, um, Atlantis Galactic, was people were frightened to be seen. No more, not allowed to. It's time to shine your brilliance. Absolutely. What does shine your brilliance say? Shine like that and that you are safe to be seen. So it's completion of that cycle. That comes in the 23rd of September. And so that's how I'm preparing because I'm still human. Oh, I'm still human. Uh, and I've got to prepare as well, even though I have the great memory and um, awareness of Mr. School and Teacher, etc. I still have the human aspect of, so even me sharing this, the, you watch my Facebook Lives and in my Mystery School um, with Jean Sheehan, the Facebook group, you watch so I'm getting braver and braver sharing things. I used to do this 2004 beyond, uh, but then I was told, time to quiet, and I've only got a short time to teach this, 2023 to 2040, just one galactic year, and then I've got to go quiet again. And so, um, the finishing off is up, finish off, there's no more shining your brilliance and um, front to be seen, that, that, no more. So, that's why, I know it sounds bizarre, but I'm gonna sit behind the rock to shine my brilliance. I'm gonna sit behind the rock to take in that golden ray of healing. You guys can be with me, just pop your name down um, on, the mess, on the live, and, but I gotta do it in uh, invisible. So not secret, but invisible, so that if anyone else comes around through the process, I can actually bring forth. Because I'm gonna be singing lang light language here. I don't really care if people know what I do or anything, but I'm gonna be singing light language and I just need to be in a solar place connecting with the dolphins and the whales. So um, yeah, if you want some healing process, like Tina's just written, yes, please, dearly needed this. Tina, definitely your one. So if you're needing to have that process, please, please, please pop your name down. Uh, and if you're not sure about Atlantis and all that sort of stuff, you go to my website, millenniumeducation.com, um, pop in the search bar, Atlantis, Lemuria, Pallades, Hathor, Arcturians. There is a whole heap of things that are for the practitioners and people that study um, mystery school with me. There is so much content. There's like 500 blogs about all of this and I keep updating them. So go and research a bit more if you need to just um, soothe the left brain. Um, otherwise, as I said, do join me in this process. Um, so, uh, as I said, I saw the dolphins when I was standing over there. Uh, I'm gonna just sit here and call in the whales. I did hear them thumping, like, you know, when they go up and type thing. Uh, and uh, the preparation is, yeah, look, prepare to be seen prepare which is end the cycle of not being seen and end the cycle of um, um, what was the thing uh, that you're not safe to be seen like it's in that cycle that starts the 23rd of September this is according to mystery school now I don't work numerology I don't have that wisdom I work it on sacred geometry uh, numbers and things so if you resonate with that with you understand what I'm saying or not if you resonate with Oh yeah, I don't feel safe to be seen. Put your name down anyway. Like, what have you got to lose? Uh, lose the fears, the phobias, uh, lose um, uh, not getting out there, lose not receiving, you know, all those sort of things. Um, join me, join me, like, look at the energy. I'm just gonna step out of the um, photo for a moment. Have a look at that. Look at that energy, just divine. So beautiful. So yeah, be with me. I'd love you to do that. And I know some of you say you can't come to Egypt with me for the processes. That's no problems. You're well with me. Just like when I did the Facebook Lives on my personal page and business page, uh, not business page, Facebook group, Mr. School with Jean Sheehan, you were with me as I walked around for four and a half hours at the pyramids and spent. You were with me. You're always with me. This is a community thing. So Katie's just written, yes, please. Um, who else wants some of the healing processes? Uh, so yeah, I'm preparing. Meditation, I need to tune into the water. Um, I'll be tapping into the mermaid energy, which is very much um, uh, what we do in Mexico, in the Mayan Odyssey. Um, uh, the mermaid energy and the Mayan wisdom, etc. Uh, but I'll be tapping into that. 
um, the and um, yeah so join me join me join me so I'm gonna end this Facebook live and put down behind my rock and just take a moment just to settle switch off and cool and I can feel my like all around not the heart chakra itself but all around this is fourth dimension fifth dimension is here and, and I can feel it already expanding uh, and if you're interested in the 2025 energies make go to my website and have a look at uh, the 9th of November we've got the offline event at Noosa where it's a whole day about the energies and how to prepare for 2025 exactly the same seminar but online on the 10th of November um, it's still the same price really cheap Andrew good morning great rising my darling good morning good morning and for those that are coming to Egypt this year came to Egypt in the past with me um, are coming are booked into Egypt next year I haven't even written the itinerary for next year we've got four people booked um, that are coming like oh my gosh that the activations and the processes for this new paradigm and fifth dimension are amazing so goddess high priestess shaman wicca witch misery of light um, guide angel mermaid unlimited names um, come with me I'm gonna be there so so much love to you all um, I'm going to now just uh, switch off the phone as well uh, because I'm trying to charge it and it's not charging which means stop talking G go do the processes so time for me to get ready and are you guys ready be seen and let go complete the cycle of fear of being seen as well time to shine a brilliance so love to you all very very much pop your names down I'll be over here you'll energetically feel it and even if you're watching the replay energetically in quantum time you'll be here with me so love to you all mm -hmm.